How's it going, lads? Marshall here, and welcome back to another review on the channel. We are live right now on fb.gg forward slash Marshall 89 hd yeah? but not right now. You're not watching this live, but I'm recording this live, so that kind of makes sense. But if you do want to come buy machines, fb.gg forward slash Marshall 89 hd yeah? link is in the description below. But finally, lads, finally, QQ Gorilla, or just QQ Gorilla, has been done. We, we have actually done QQ Gorilla. It took so long. I don't know how people do it on the same night of release. I respect the grinds. They smash it. They do it well. But uh, we've done Cucurella. We did it all in Rivals. No squad battles. We ain't about that line. But uh, Cucurella, I'm yet to play with him, of course, but he does look really good. The other versions of Cucurella, as we were doing them, lads, um, were decent. And I played him striker to get the, the assist, the goals, and even clean sheets at times. But uh, we have done Cucurella, and I'm so, so happy to do this, guys. Lads, if you do enjoy this review, because... God knows, it took me, um, it took me about seven hours, seven, eight hours, ridiculous. But uh, lads, if you do enjoy, a like would be very much appreciated from you guys. Subscribe to the channel if you want more reviews and more content because this is content season. We're gonna drop you so much content on this channel and I do appreciate all you guys that do support me. Thank you so, so much. Uh, like the video, comment in the comment section below. Have you done Cucurella? Will you do Cucurella? Let me know in the comments. As for Cucurella, he does, I love seeing his name, so I'm going to see it all the way through this review. Cucurella is a brilliant, brilliant name. Uh, Ex-Barcelona or on loan from Barcelona, I'm not too sure right there. He's got high and medium work, left for primarily four star skills and a four star weak part. Lads, looking at his attributes, this guy is as versatile as they come. As versatile as they come. He's got acceleration. To the moon, to the absolute moon. He's got shooting, he's got passing, he's got dribbling, he's got defender with a shadow chem style, and he's got the physicality, including the stamina too. So let's run through his pace. He's got 89 acceleration, 89 sprint speed, 99 with a shadow chem style. And the reason I'm using the shadow chem style is because I'm going to play him centrally. Because, like I said, he's versed out. He could play left back and he could do it to a great job and great effect. Centrally, it's centre mid. I reckon this guy bosses it as a box-to-box -box midfielder, and that's where we're going to test him today. Um, he's got great pace, especially with a shadow of 99 apiece. He's got 94 attack position, 84 finishing, 87 shot power, 84 long shots, 76 and 74 in terms of volleys and penalties. The passing looks great as well. 87 vision, 89 crossing for those wide areas, 89, uh, 89, where are we getting 89 from? Uh, 90 short pass, 88 long pass, and 87 curve with the dribbling coming in at 87 agility, which is good enough for any player in this game, especially a centre mid. 94 balance, 91 reactions, 89 ball control, 88 dribbling, and a lowly 82 composure, but that's not even that low if you if you think about it, boys. Um, the shadow chem style enhances the interceptions, defensive awareness, all, all those stats basically. Yeah. Defensive awareness, very important. Interceptions, probably more important, especially getting that to a high stat of 89. Uh, Stand tackle, very important too, 94 in total. And slide tackle, going to 98. The physicality, one of these stats in here is especially important, and that's the stamina. Um, because as a box to box and even a left back, you want them motoring all game long, running all game long, and getting from box to box and defending and attacking at the same time. He's got 97. Strength is on the low side is 74, but he does have 84 aggression. He's got decent jumping as well. Traits! He's got the flare trait, that's not bad. Uh, I didn't really expect much, and I haven't looked at the traits from Cucurella throughout. Um, yeah, he is called Cucurella. I always call him Q -Q Cucurella. I, 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 I've got no idea. Well, lads, we're going to review him right now. And the position he's going to play will be, and I'll show you right now, the attacking ultra press. We've got so much pressure on my opponent. He's going to play right there in the center mid spots alongside Marquinhos and Hullet. And um, we've got the rest of the strikers sorted as well. So without any further ado, let's get in the clips. We get, or we got, or we will get with Q Cucurella. Future stars. 87. I want to say Cucu, Cucu, I can't even say his name. I want to say Cucu Corella so much. I really, really do. But lads, let's get into the review. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, that was too readable. Ah, I've got the overlap too. Oh, I wanted to say, rebounds. It's got Pope in Nets. To Cucu Corella. Marquinhos. Cucu Corella. Hey, nice man, nice. How deep his defense is, boys. Oh, he was on the overlap too. Come on. Cucurella's there, because I've got a high press on, so he's always there, a crossbody. Did that deflect? Because Cucurella, he's celebrating like this. He's just got a brilliant finish. Um, Did that deflect? I, I, at least let us see. I thought that deflected, boys. Cucurella with the block. 
What's happening? Hey, Cucurella with the block there, though, boys. And he will burst from midfield. Do you know who I, I, I liken Cucurella to? Marcus Acuna. Oh, no, what are you doing? Oh, no! Yeah, I, I reckon he's very similar to Marcus Acuna. He can play in numerous positions, left, back, and center mids. Cucurella. <laughs> Dude, he's, he's really quick at accelerating. Hey, go on, you still got that. He didn't even go down the ground, but... Hey, ref! Shemedo. Cucurella, brilliant challenge. And that's why he's good box-to-box, because -box, he can defend and he can attack. From there... Nah, he just nearly broke the stratosphere. What was that strike? Hey, I want to try it again, just for the bounce. Oh, uh, that's not a bounce. He's won the ball. Hey, he's combatant. I just nearly broke the bloody stratosphere, boys. That's the one to... Oh, it's just so nice. Cuckoo, Cucurella. On side? You'd love to see it, boys. Two goals in his debut. I like this card. I, I, I'm going to say already, he's better than the 86. Because a lot of people's going upgrades, and then they get to the 86 before the 87, and are settling for that cards. This card's doing more in one match than that card did in like 15. A period. It, honestly, he is. He's doing way more in this one match than the other one did in like... And you've almost playing striker too. Cucurella. There's the one. He's going for the two, you know. He's got the two. There's Mbappe. Cucurella! Dudes. I, I, I'm excited about Cucurella. Are you excited about Cucurella? You should be excited about Cucurella. Because Cucurella's got a great finish on him. Cucurella can go box to box. I like saying his name. Don't judge me. Nice, Cucurella. Gives him a space to pass the ball. Stupid man. Hey, finesse from there, Neymar. I mean, I don't mind if I do. I do not mind if I do. Do that celebration with everyone. Hey, Cucurella's got his dance on, lads. There he is, man. And then... Oh, dude, I've got so many passes. I don't... Too many options. What a pass. I had too many options, boys. Simple as that. Hey, Cucurella. Bad pass. Bad pass. So nice. Hey, Mbappe, I want to see if I can kill this round defender. Terrible chip, but I, I definitely could pass that right. Cucurella, you see that pass there? It goes to show that Cucurella could definitely play left back and play those passes down the line. Because if he can do that in that position, he can do it out wide without any effort. This is Division 1 too, boys. He could, he could do that out wide without, like, effortless. That's the word I was looking for. That's good footwork, you know. Oh, no, stop this, Cucurella. Let's put it wise, but that's... It's good dribbling for Cucurella. Right then, lads. So that was Cucurella. The main question about Cucurella is always, especially with this one anyways, and the same question with, was it Renier, Rena? The main question is, is he worth the time? Is he worth the grinds? Will he get into teams? That's three questions. It's not even a main question. But basically, is he worth the time? Yes and no. This is a very, very difficult one to get. It's a very time consuming objective. It's gonna take you a long, long time. I personally did it in Rivals, I didn't do Squad Battles because Squad Battles, I probably would have fell asleep at least five times, but um, doing this Cucurella was really, really, uh, uh, almost a chore boys, but it gives you something to do on the game, and this guy performs, this guy really does perform, so performance and your abilities and stuff like that, yes, if you don't want to break your balls doing this SPC, and SPC, objective, and you think, you know what, I, don't, I generally don't have time to do it, but I want to do it, don't stress it lads, don't stress it, Especially if you've got someone like Acuna, uh, the left back from uh, that uh, division as well, La Liga. He is a mirror image of Cucurella, in my personal opinion anyways. They are very versatile players. This Cucurella, he could play left mid very, very simply in a 3-5-2. He could play left wing, he could play left back, he could play CDM. This guy is as versatile as he come in this game as in playing in the midfield defence and attack. A uh, very, very good sense of that. Like, you would have seen his left foot was a one at times too. He's got three goals in the two games played and the one assist. Uh, comes with four star, four star and high to medium work rates. They are sensational. Uh, skill moves, weak foot and work rates. That's a um, couple any player, attack and player, defensive player and midfield player in this game. As a tribute, he lives up to them. He definitely lives up to them in game. The rates that I'm going to give Cucurella, and I've debated this with the stream too. Um, some say 9.1, but I reckon it was a little bit higher than the 9.1. 
I reckon it's 9.3 slash 9.4, and I'm going to stay with the 9.3. He's a very versatile player, and that is what gives him the edge over a lot of different players on this game. His versatility knows no bounds, and it is incredible what this guy can do. In terms of the value for time, this is a really tough one. Uh, a 9. I'm going to give him a 9 value for time. It's not one of those ones, like, normally value for time is like 10, 9.8, stuff like that, because they are free cards. But this one is so grindy, it's, um... It's ridiculous because in, in rivals and stuff like that, you don't get rage quits. In squad battles, you don't get rage quits. In friendlies, they quit after one, two, maybe three goals. So again, you can see why it'd be quicker in friendlies as opposed to rivals and squad battles. But he is quite the grind. Enjoyment rating, it's up there, boys. It would be like a 9.4. And um, the meta rating for this card. Uh, honestly, this card is a very meta card in this game. It's got a lot going from the flare trait too. Uh, and uh, it's just meta in general. So I'd give him probably a 9 on the meta scale. Well, that's, that's going to be it for Cucurella on this review. If you do want to see uh, more in-depth stats and... Um, Stuff like that. If you want to see it visually, the ratings, Instagram, Master89YT. Uh, it's not HD because someone stole it. Thank you very much to that Instagram user. But lads, thank you very much for watching today. If you have enjoyed this review and you've enjoyed the content, lads, I'm loving doing these live reviews. It reinvigorates me. I'm going to get more content out of you guys. I'm going to get more standards out to you guys. Standards? Don't even know what I mean by that. But I'm going to get way more reviews out to you guys and way more content to you guys. So thank you very much for watching. Like if you have enjoyed and let me know your thoughts on Cucurella or Cuckoo Gorilla in the comment section below. But thank you very much for joining. Like, comment, subscribe, all the good stuff. Hope you had a great day and I will catch you all next time.